When I was like, growing up on the farm, most kids probably uh, growing up on farms, I guess, always wanted to tinker with stuff, play with stuff and that. And always had sort of a mind where I loved designing things or, you know, making something out of scrap or, you know, be an old bag trolley or something, make stuff for Toby on the motorbike, like, uh, you know, just stuff the stuff around me. And, like, you know, I love sort of hanging around with my dad, doing things on the farm, uh, you know, seeing what he would do sort of thing and then, you know, doing the same. And uh, just, yeah, I suppose always wanted to be hands-on sort of, um, really, you know, enjoy your making stuff and, all, you know, thinking things up and that. And like, you know, come to school when I got into uh, year, like, you know, year seven, year eight, uh, start metal work and wood and that. And I've always, like, I've always preferred metal work over, over woodwork. And so I just sort of went down that path and showed all interest in it. And like, you know, doing it from a young age, I wasn't bad at it to start off coming to school. So always want to tinker around with stuff, make stuff, you know, just being an well, engineer, just really sort of, uh, making things is something I really sort of enjoy, so and something I've always really done when I was young. So. There's always something that you want to make. You've got to have a passion for it. To be able to produce something from a flat state to a folded state and something that's actually usable um, and, and take great pride in, I enjoy it. Look, see, when I finish my apprenticeship, I'd, I'd you know, love to travel, sort of go in Australia, more or less, and I'd love to look at mine work, like, you know, while, you know, of course, while I'm still young, make some money and stuff like that, sort of setting yourself up for later in life. And, uh, like, I'd love to stay in this industry, maybe when I get older, but, I'd, you know, it's uh, something I want to do while I'm young. Use it, you know, it's, and it's a valuable industry, like, you can get a lot of different sort of career paths with it. And, uh, like, you know, it's, it's a good, just a good skill to have, and with, like, with work, like, where I work as well, getting tickets and stuff that involves this industry. If you can get them, you become a valuable employee to someone else later in the track. You know, I'm a, an appealing employee because you know I've you know, got my ticket in engineering, like a Cert 3, you know, clearly know how to weld, stuff like that, and like just engineering in general. Most aspects like what we learn here gives me a good grasp on it. So, you know, then someone looks to want to uh, use me, you know, as an employee, you know, it's, uh, it's, it sets you up pretty good, like, you know, you've, this trade here is, you know, you've sort of get a good grasp on a big broad range of things, so. Sets you up, I reckon it does give you a great opportunity.